Here he comes now, JT Energy, the QC cup holder, sporting that Mugatu hairdo and a, a brand new filthy mustache night. I am not a huge fan of mustaches, especially that kind, but I gotta say, if there was one man on the planet that could pull it off, it's JT Energy. Hi, Wagner, we wanna welcome you to the second half of this episode of SCW Pro Unleashed. Happy you're here, kinda. May, actually, I gotta be honest, I'm not happy you're here tonight. I like the spotlight all for myself, you know that. Well, you know what, the time has come for you to stop acting on your own and welcoming bigger and better talent to the commentary table. Are you commenting on your current size, Nightwear? Uh, I'm commenting on a lot of things. I don't even know what that is. Back to the action here. Would you like to comment on a little bit of that? I, I would got. Uh, he's, if he's the filthy can of wash off, it sometimes looks like he's trying, and it ain't working. Look at this man. He got you a little tongue tied there, Nightwear. Just a little. Look at this. this is, uh, 432 abs on JT Energy here today. I counted them. Don't question me. I counted every ab. When's the last time this man's had a car? The year was 1989. That makes sense. The Happy Meal had just come out. <laughs> SCW Pro. Guess who's here? J T Energy. The QC Cup champion. The man that wears crotches hair around his neck like a crown. Like the king that I am. You need to know that I'm not going anywhere, and it doesn't matter who comes out to face me. They are all going to go down for the one, two, three. Crotch, I hope you had a good holiday season. I hope you got to sit there next to the fire and look at that piece of crap haircut that I gave you. Don't plan on coming back anytime soon. I'll take more than your hair next time. You will be a figment of the SCW Pro fans' imagination. If anybody is going to imagine anything from this point forward, it is this glistening, gorgeous body of the Six Star Booty. Your QC Cup Champion 2021. We are gonna get real nasty. <laughs> well, that was creepy night. I got nothing. And his opponent. Max Heath, but we will uh, we'll keep this one rolling here. Max Heath, uh, this is a non-title match, I've been told. Non-title match. A non-cup match. Cup, title, who gives a... I keep thinking the music has ended and then it starts again. All right, Max Heath, an up-and-comer, getting in there with a much more experienced and accomplished JT Energy. Let's see what this kid brings to the table. Don't think it's enough. Abs versus keg. Here we go. What's up? I can get down with the keg. What are you doing? JT Energy, he's got that, uh, you know, he calls it the filth you can't wash off. I call it just a whole big bag of creepiness. 
you know, you, you say that, but I gotta say that it, as disturbing and creepy as he can be sometimes, when you think about the mental game behind it, when you think about a guy who's trying to throw his opponents off, you can't argue that there's no one that does it better than him. You got a point there, Knight Wagner, and sure enough, he's been quite successful using that strategy here as of late. The QC Cup holder, the man who uh, cut off Crotch's hair, the man who dislocated Shane Boucher's elbow. JT Energy is on a tear here in SCW Pro. Uh, don't remind me of that elbow thing. I, I remember it like it was yesterday. I almost threw up. Yeah. JT Energy in control here, sending Max Heath into the turnbuckle. Max Heath, a relative newcomer, does have one victory here in SCW Pro against fellow rookie Riot Ramon. JT Energy, uh, many more victories than that. Oh, absolutely. He's been on a complete tear ever since he broke it off with Josh C. He has just been onward and upward, climbing the ladder of success in SCW. Looks a little bit annoyed with those strikes from Heath there. Oh, reverses the Irish whip into a short-armed kitchen sink. You gotta wonder if he's taking Max Heath a little bit lightly. Can't say I blame him for as much success as he's had lately in this new, well, this newbie trying to bring it to him. Trying to bring it to him. Trying was the key word in that sentence, Knight Wagner, and it looked like he was doing nothing but kind of just annoying and frustrating our QC Cup holder. And that's the champ at work right there. JT Energy taking the boost to Max Heath in the corner here. Right hands, kicks, and now just a blatant choke. A blatant choke. Didn't even need to do that, Knight. He was in control. This man is just pure evil. Well, JT Energy doesn't care. He's never had a reason to care. Everything he does wins. He wins matches, he wins championships. Nobody can tell him to do anything different. JT Energy grabbing Max Heath, sending him across the ring now. Once again, driving him into those turnbuckles. Looks like he might, oh, there it is. That's the classic JT Energy right there. Always finds time to bust the move. Uh, maybe should have thought about another time right there. Yeah, JT Energy, you got served. Look at that spine buster, dead center of the ring. This is the opening that Max Heath needed. Could be going for that moonsault here. Hits it every time. Oh, no water in the pool. Uh, Has said, anyone said that before? Uh, someone said that a lot. He did not hit it that time. Oh, and the massive scissors kick. I've seen it now. But good enough. JT Energy wins. Your winner, JT Energy. JT Energy making quick work of Max Heath here tonight. This was a non-title contest, but it didn't even matter. He walks in as the cup holder, he leaves as the cup holder, and he leaves victorious. Once again, JT Energy proving why he is one of those dominant champions in SCW history. Hard to argue with that night, Wagner. You may not like the way he's gone about things, but you may like it, I sure don't. But he is effective. He the oh, no. Oh, my God. What have you done, John G? Referee John G dropping the QC Cup. And JT Energy doesn't look too pleased about it. Uh-oh. I mean, I'd be offended, too, but what's going to happen if he puts his hands on the official? He needs to think this through. He's smiling now. Maybe maybe all's forgiven. We're good. We're good. He, he, he energy is a reason to the person, isn't he? Oh, oh no! Oh, my. Despicable. What has he done? JT Energy putting his hands on referee John G. Referee John G is not a trained professional. No. He is not a fighter. No. Oh, JT is. He needs to think this through. Oh, oh my God. No. He, he's going to stab him. Oh, no, he's probably going to cut his hair, though. Yeah, what do you think? Oh, no. No. But, I mean, so the hair kind of sucks. Oh, yeah, I agree. But you, you can't do this to an SCW official. No, you can't. He's already crossed the line, but, I mean, who cares if he keeps crossing it? I guess do us all a favor now. Oh, no. Oh, he, oh, he manscaped Elmo. 
Cookie Monster, maybe? Oh, sorry. Oh, that's just absolutely despicable. I cannot believe the actions of JT Energy as of late. There are no words to describe the kind of tear he's been on. Somebody's got to put an end to this. Uh, right now, it doesn't look like anyone's going to stop JT Energy. himself, Mike Wagner. Nobody has stopped him. He's just done everything he wants to run rough shot over official wrestling. That referee needs to watch out too. Yeah, that, that referee's gonna get his his mustache shaved if he's not careful. That would also be a favor, but he needs to maybe not press the button. We have another official out here checking on head referee, senior referee John G. Good luck. It's not going anywhere. I dare you, Crotch. I dare you to show. Come on. It looks like looks like JT Energy lost a, a lens in his glasses. Now he's gonna go to the, the, the GD sunglass factory and start shaving heads left and right. Disgusting. 